Welcome back, Family of Light. This is Davida with Medium of the Light Tarot. Capricorns, hello. Good to see you, or I guess not see you. But if you are new here, welcome. If you are a returner, welcome back. All right. So if this one doesn't end up resonating with you, make sure that you check out the playlist that I have has lots of detailed other readings for Capricorns. This is the Modern Witch Tarot. And if you hear lots of kitty noises, it's because it snowed out at the time of this reading and my cat is crazy about snow. And he always wants to go out there run around with his head cut off <laughs> and just on time sorry kid not right now all right so this is you this is them this is the storyline you've got the nine of wands the three of wands and the temperance card your person has the hierophant the magician and the two of wands. So there's zero doubt that you guys have a lot of fiery, passionate feelings towards each other. You know, this is very significant for your person because there's this majors here. Looks like you're trying to protect yourself from something. What I'm just hearing from spirit, just in, um, is that there's something that you're trying, you're, you feel like something's coming and you're trying to protect yourself from it. It's like you're waiting for an attack or you're waiting for the other shoe to drop, is what I'm hearing. With the three of wands here, You're, you're trying to be positive for the future and you're waiting for your ships to come in because you've already been planning, but it's kind of like, you know, here too, where you're, you're on the defensive, even with this one, where you're looking out for a possible enemy incoming. Now, why is that guys? I hear for some of you, you have some kind of a, um, For you personally, like a legal situation happening? For the majority of you, it's like a corporation involved, like um, your, your old employer, you know, something like that where it's a, you know, a corporation or an old employer who you're having some kind of a legal situation with. So it's very much preoccupying your mind. And you know that there's patience involved in divine timing. <clears throat> but you are waiting for the, the other shoe to drop. Now let's do... What I call the 3D cards here. Yeah, and this is causing you a lot of despair. Not like you're going to want to kill yourself, but this is showing the extreme of it where it's, there's so much despair and it's, you know, it's almost like it's, I feel all this anxiety, like you're, you're just, your system is all hyped up and you're like, I'm ready, I'm ready. But then you're ready, but all it is is waiting. It's like you're waiting for a message. You know, this is just like tearing you apart, you know, and or flip the storyline as it reads because this could be your person. So you know that I'm nosy if you've been here before. So leave a comment about what it is. I don't know who are you and what's going on. You don't have to give like super details, but you know, thief. You know, I definitely feel here. I mean, obviously, if you're in a, 
a legal battle here, you know, or some kind of a judgment, you do feel like someone's taken advantage of you or not giving you what is due you. Young woman. Tell me about this, guys. This could have something to do with a younger woman. Yeah, I'll leave a comment down below because they're saying it'll be individual for each person. Okay, so this is an interesting one because, you know, obviously your reading so far has been all about what the heck's happening in your personal life. Your person. They're wanting to up-level the situation and they realize that there's going to be justice that needs to be served here, not on your situation, because they're aware of your situation. And they have a lot of uh, positive vibes towards you. And they're also, you know, planning and waiting as you are for this to come through, because this is the two of wands here. It's like they're waiting for the call, too, from you saying, okay, it's done. Or, okay, this is what the verdict was. You know, it doesn't have to be, you know, work-related. You'll know better than me. All right. You know, and the overall card is the Knight of Pentacles here. You know, if like you're waiting for money to come in, it's going to be slow moving, hence the temperance card. So, okay, we're just going to do this all different because this one is very different. You know, and here it's um, the high priestess, the three of swords, and the four of wands. So it's been a lot of watching, silently, waiting. There's been a lot of heart heartbreak associated with this. You know, and maybe even with this despair card, someone killed themselves or someone died, and then it's a part of this lawsuit. And it's kind of made it to where you've had to back off from this person, but they understand. Or the stress of it for you is just so overwhelming. You know, but here is the Four of Wands, the 1111 card, the commitment card. So both of you want this. I can feel this. It's just whatever this situation is, is really... This one popped out. Children. Your love life is being affected by children. Let's see where to put this. Attraction came out also. I mean, obviously there's a ton of attraction here. And there's lots of patience and love here with this children card you know maybe figuring out who who you know in a divorce who gets the child the children the child this one definitely could be an extended but i'm not doing extendeds for these this series so if this one is something that you want to have a private reading for, the description box will have the info for a reading. I do $50 for a reading. So you can get on there and get on my schedule if you so choose. It is safe for you to love. Open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all. Because I feel like it's hard for you to exhale. Because whatever the situation is, there's a lot at stake here. You know, especially if it's, you know, custody of children, adoption of a child, whatever it is. True love. This is the romance of a lifetime. And you know that and they know that. Because it's really interesting. It's like, because the situation is so up in the front, your person has really backed their energy off. And they're just being so kind and supportive from a distance. That's why they're waiting, they're patiently waiting here 
so you guys can build this life together that's right here. Now, give me more information about this Nine of Wands here. The King of Pentacles is shown. Yeah, money with this Three of Wands. You know, waiting for something to be revealed. With this Temperance card, waiting for the new beginning. Yeah, it's like you guys are just waiting. Waiting for this verdict. But the Hierophant is the Eight of Wands. So your person knows, you know, that communication is coming forward. They're just waiting for it. You know, and you guys do communicate a lot. It's just they really pull their energy back out of respect for you. So the Magician card and the Queen of Wands, they have so much fiery passion and energy for you. And they're going to create this with you after the situation is complete. But the Two of Wands is the Tower card. You know, it's like both of you, you're waiting for the best and you're hoping for not getting the worst. But the High Priestess is the Devil. You know, what I just heard is that, you, you know, you guys feel like you are dealing with the devil. You know, the devil is an opposing person or an opposing corporation, whatever it is. So the three of swords here comes the ace of wands. And, you know, a new fiery passionate beginning after the heartbreak. And with this four of wands here is the five of wands. So it's like you're waiting for this to be over so the Four of Wands can come in and, you know, you, so you guys can have the happy commitment that is forthcoming. I have zero doubt that if this reading resonates with you completely, that you guys are getting together. It's just going to take a little bit of <sighs> temperance and patience, right? So with this Knight of Pentacles is the world card, which is great. You know, I was saying, like, if you're waiting for money, it's going to take a while, right? But this is the outcome, the world. I wanted to sound more dramatic, but it didn't work out. <laughs> All right. Yeah, sun card comes out. So after all this drama trauma, the sun card comes out. The happiest card in the deck. You know, and to me, that is a relaxing feeling to go, okay, after all this, after all this drama, you know, wish fulfillment, the happiest card in the deck, it's coming. You just may need to be patient. And it's, yeah, you guys are going to be happy. It's going to be good. Just patience is involved. And know that your person is there waiting. And if you've been confused by them backing off, it's been about them trying to be respectful for what's going on and trying to support you at a distance. You know, and this also could be a, you know, you're in the middle of a, a nasty divorce and this person is waiting for you and they want to be respectful so it doesn't cause any extra drama trauma, especially if there's children involved. And then if they, not, you know, like the embarrassment or something, you're like, oh, I'm getting together with someone else and that's why I want to dump your dad or your mom or the they, you know? So know that this is going to be okay if this completely resonates with you. And I will see you guys next time on Medium of the Light Tarot. Bye-bye.